Good morning, everyone. So we, uh, it is 8.03, and Harold got up at 7.30. Um, he only woke up one time last night, which was at 3.30, um, which was normal for him because usually I feed him between 10 and 11, but I didn't because the last couple of times that I've been feeding him, waking him up to feed him, he's wanted to stay awake. So I waited till he woke up, which was around, well, 3.15. Um, and then I was back in bed by like 3.50 or so. Um, so he, like I said, got up around 7.15, 7.30, and he nursed. He's actually uh, right here drinking a bottle. Um, we are, my milk supply has been dwindling um, or did for a period of time. Um, and so we had tried him on formula, and he refused to drink any of it um, so kind of make me nervous um, for if we did have to wean him um, how difficult the transition would be so I periodically now give him a bottle of formula to try and get him used to the taste and just within the past week he has actually um, started to drink it so he is still nursing um, but he generally has a couple ounces of formula a day um, like between one and four ounces. Um, so yeah, but I am going to take a shower once he's done eating and then we will get dressed and start our day. He still needs to get dressed if you can tell he's just in his diaper. So vlogging today has been rough. I have re-recorded things a ton of times so We'll see how this goes, but it so far it's looking like I'm not supposed to do a day in life today. Um, Harold was being really fussy, so I laid him down. I think that he might have been awake in his crib um, for a while before he woke up. Sometimes when Daddy gets him up, he waits till he starts crying, so he could have been playing in his crib for a while. Um, so we'll see, or he could have just you know not got enough sleep and still be tired. Um, but, uh, I laid him back down so far he's not crying, which is usually a sign that he's going to sleep right away, so, um, but it is 8.15 and I'm going to wait for about 10 minutes to see if he actually does go to sleep and then I'm going to jump in the shower. Okay, so Harold did fall asleep. It is almost 9 a.m. and, um, I just got a shower and I am going to, um, I think attempt to put some makeup on. I'm not sure when he's gonna wake up, um, but we'll see how far I get. <laughs> so Oliver loves wet food. I give him. Um, about every other day I'll give him a little bit of wet food with some um, some Vaseline. Um, I was going to show it to you guys, but I don't know where I put it. Anyways, it's just basic Vaseline. Um, but it is to help with um, hairballs because him and Kitty both, um, and in a second, I'll, when he's done, I'll put him outside so Kitty can have hers because he hogs it all. But anyways... Um, they both, like, pull out their fur and, like, lick it, like, eat it. They, I mean, they've been to the vet and nothing's wrong with them. They just like to pull out their fur and eat it. Um, so hairballs are something we constantly deal with. Um, and they throw up a lot because they can't get the hairballs passed. So once I started giving them this, um, the hairballs have pretty much gone away. So or the, the hairballs, I see them every now and then, but the vomiting every day has pretty much gone away, which is great because I was tired of cleaning it up. So it is 9.56 and I am having some really unhealthy brunch, I guess. It's actually a lunch, but um, it is a frozen freezer meal. That's chicken and mashed potatoes. It's a banquet meal. Um, but it was quick and easy and the baby is still napping. I am also going to, um, if it will load, watch um, a little bit of episode of Pretty Little Liars on Hulu. Um, I'm planning to just watch it while I eat, but we'll see. 
because I also need to go work in the kitchen. So that's the plan for right now. It's 10.30 and Harold just woke up from his nap. So he must have been really tired because I don't remember what time I laid him down, but slept for a while, longer than I thought he would. Hi, buddy. What are you doing? Okay, so every morning after he gets up from, usually for the day between morning and his nap, um, it's usually between 9 and 10 that he eats his breakfast. And, um, but since he slept weird today, um, he's just now getting it. Um, it is <clears throat> mixed berries, baby food, and that we're just trying to use up. And then um, some oatmeal mixed in, and his vitamins are mixed in as well. So it's just one jar of baby food. Um, we were given a bunch of it, and so we're just trying to use it up. Um, but generally every morning around, like I said, between 9 and 10, he'll have one jar of baby food that's fruit mixed with oatmeal and his vitamin. In the evening, he gets vegetables and uh, usually like barley or rice cereal. So it is 12.01 and Harold is taking another nap. He is, it's weird. Today he's been more tired, but earlier he was in such a great mood. Um, like, really good mood. He was giggling and usually it's really hard to get him to laugh and he was, you know, babbling and just crazy. Um, so it was so cute. But uh, he's napping again, and Daddy should be home soon. He's on his way. Um, he had to go to the doctor this morning. So, um, yeah, so we'll wait for him to get home, which he'll be going to sleep soon after he gets home because he works tonight. But um, I should be cleaning the kitchen, but instead I'm watching YouTube videos. Um... So, yeah, I need to go do that. But, because that's the easiest to do it while he's, while Harold's sleeping. So, yeah. Uh, it's really nice outside, but it's been really hot. And yesterday we had a huge storm. Well, huge for us. Because I live in Ohio, and so we don't really have many storms. Um... But we had a thunderstorm yesterday. It was really windy for like 10 minutes. <laughs> but it was really windy. And uh, it actually made me a little nervous. Um, I love storms, but uh, I... What? Yeah? I'm vlogging here. Can you move? No? Come on, go away. What's your name? Yeah? Do you want to go outside? No? Okay. Um, anyways, the was, wind was making me nervous. I guess we have like tornado sirens, but they test them on Wednesdays or Tuesdays or something, and I never hear them test them, so I don't know if they're louder when they actually happen, but it makes me nervous because if they're not louder then I don't hear them and so if there were um, you know we live in an older house so obviously it's been here for I don't know, over a hundred years so I mean the chances of it standing are pretty good but I mean it's old <laughs> so anyways I actually the baby was not napping he was like talking and so I actually went and got him um, just because the wind was so strong um, and so he played down here because his room's upstairs. And, but yeah, it lasted all of like 20 minutes, the whole storm, and it was lifted. Uh, it wasn't as dark and blah, blah, blah. But it's actually nice outside, sunny. Well, it's a little overcast, but, um, it's so hot and muggy, which is weird because Ohio usually isn't, um, uh, humid. Um, but yeah, really... See, my cat's retarded, and 
Like I was telling you earlier, he rips out his fur. Can you see that? <laughs> oh, whatever. Uh, he rips it out, and then it'll get stuck on his mouth, and he licks it and eats it. So that's why he gets crazy hair. So it is one, almost one ten, and Harold's still sleeping. Um, he should be up anytime, but I'm going to go lay down with, uh, hubby's already sleeping, but I'm just going to go lay down until he wakes up, so, because I'm tired. Okay, so I just came up here and, um, brought up, I made me some hot tea, well, warm tea, and I have these, oh, Biscoff, uh, I don't know if you can see that, cookies, um, I don't know if it's backwards or not. Anyways, um, so I'm going to have those with some tea. Um, I have been craving hot tea. Um, it's like sweet tea that's heated because I'm from Florida and we drink sweet tea. So it's not like a tea bag dipped in. I made a whole batch of sweet tea. Um, but anyways, I've been craving it for days, weeks, a long time. Especially when I found these cookies, then I was like, oh, it would be so good with hot tea. And I am freezing today for some reason. I don't know why, but I laid down for, and got a short nap, um, maybe about 30 minutes or so. But the whole time I've been freezing. So this is perfect. Um, Harold is in his crib. I gave him a little bit of... Just a few puffs um, to keep him occupied because obviously I cannot hold him while I'm drinking hot tea. Um, so he's there and I could really use a little bit of caffeine right about now. So he's there and then as soon as, um, well either if he starts fussing then I'll get him and nurse him. Um, but if he's okay I'll probably give him a few toys in there and try and drink my tea and have my cookies. I'm just going to sit in here with him. Um, and yeah, there's Oliver trying to get his food and Kitty should be close by. There's Kitty. Um, <laughs> but yeah, um, he has been doing really well in his crib for a while. It seemed like when he would wake up, he would wake up crying. Um, and I don't know if that was a phase, but, um, or if there was like something causing it because I mean he did it um, you know pretty much up until um, maybe a month and a half ago um, where sorry I heard some weird noise outside because um, he's always been a self soother um, but I don't know he just wakes up happier I don't know if it's he's getting the right amount of sleep during the day and at night and so he just all in all a happier baby but it's great but the, it, the problem with that is it's easy to um, let him you know just coo in his crib while I you know take a little extra nap or whatever but I try and um, be sure to not let him play too long because to, I don't want him to start crying because I don't for one that's not necessary and obviously I don't want him to associate it with you know being left in there so um, but it is nice that he doesn't wake up screaming. Usually, though, he cries as soon as I walk in the door, um, which I know is normal for babies. They just get overwhelmed, and that's the easiest emotion for them to display. But, um, but yeah, he's doing, he's getting so big. He's growing so fast, and actually, I guess I should be doing an eight-month update, so maybe I'll try and film that today. We just went on a walk. Um, it's around four. And it's time for his nap again. Um, he usually sleeps every two hours. He goes down for a nap every two hours. Um, but today he's been a little off. He was really happy this morning and after his last nap he has been grouchy. So um, he's going back down for his nap. We went for a walk and it was really nice. We got to talk to some neighbors. And uh, so yeah, I'm gonna catch my breath and then I will uh, talk to you again in a